Hello everyone, welcome once again to Spicy Talk with Onwadia. Thank you so much for stopping by and if today is your first time coming across this channel, thank you so much. Please consider subscribing, hit the like button and turn on your notification bell so you get notified whenever I upload a new video. And for you my returning subscribers, what can I say? Thank you so much for always coming around to support this lady. And today I am bringing you guys something I saw over the weekend. It's about incest between two siblings in the community these two siblings were banished by the elders of the community for engaging in abominable act and um, of course in that land it is not uh, accepted it defies the land spice it up baby spice it up boy come and give me all cause tonight i'm feeling so far welcome back like i said these two siblings engaged in incest and incest according to the laws of the land in Akagu community in the in Ludi. I will not mention the state. It is a strong abomination that they don't condone at all. So these two siblings were caught in the act actually committing incest and even medically incest is not advised because um, it affects the blood. The child, any child child born from incest relationship is what well, most times uh, have deformity so but religiously and um, um, traditionally it is an abomination in the land and most times what is done is they cleanse the land after banishing the culprits they take them to the boundary of the community and then send them away sometimes they even burn their belongings um in in, in some cases they burn their belongings and they just send them away never to ever return to that community and if at all they return uh something is going to happen to them uh, either the community will come together and delete them in a way to appease the land and you know cleanse the land of such abomination now because the 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 akagu security was were asked to send them to this place that is the boundary uh and among the the security uh, they, they also have the coordinators and some members of the akago security that uh may ensure that these people don't enter in you know come back into the community they will walk away from here never to look back never to return to that community and um sometimes they equally anyone who who engages in spilling blood like spilling blood of siblings blood of parents or any parent engaging in uh, uh, spilling blood uh they are also banished from communities and i've seen cases where some people are actually stripped before they banish them that is those who engage in some evil some evil activities they strip them parade them throughout the community and do some sacrifice then banish them from that community now i have a few questions to ask why would a brother and a sister decide to engage in incest knowing is an abomination in their land a girl can find a boyfriend a boy a guy can equally find a girlfriend why did this guy not go look for a girlfriend instead of sleeping with a sister or why did he not allow her get a boyfriend is this a case of jealousy not wanting anybody to touch his sister and i we have seen cases where fathers engage in this kind of dirty affair with their daughters even get them pregnant and some daughters have children for their fathers do you guys know that some mothers are aware of this thing happening but because they want to protect their marriage they don't speak out they cover this thing why not send that child pretending she got pregnant outside sincerely there are certain abominations that shouldn't be condoned in communities and this is the reason why we are having issues in, in you know in our lands this is the, because abominations have been allowed to you know to thrive in the community 
It shouldn't be encouraged. And I really love what these people did, what the elders did, their verdict of sending these people out of the community. is a warning signal to everyone out there in the community. This place is not where you can commit such abomination and get away with it. It's not encouraged in this community. So every other person out there will be on the lookout. They will be careful knowing the consequences that they will never ever return to this land like they have been banished for life so let me know guys are you in support of what these people did is such still practice where you are like in your land in your community in your village do they still practice things like this let me know in the comment section because i have seen a lot of communities where things like this are not condoned and uh, they after banishing them they will have to perform set some rights do certain things to cleanse the land so that it will not speak against them and to also let their ancestors know that they didn't encourage and will never encourage this because these are the things that keep a society clean from evil and also from calamities i know in this era of christianity some people will say no uh the, the, this uh, uh old archaic practice and shouldn't be encouraged in this modern time but let's let's even ask ourselves where has it led us to what has become of our land what has become of our people take for instance look at the killings the blood spilling between siblings over minor issues a sibling would pick up a weapon and use it against another sibling or is it even the ones carried out by parents themselves or even some mothers giving birth and doing some crazy things to the children a lot of abominations and the more we encourage it the more we keep quiet the more these things you know continue to happen in the community people are no longer afraid of god they don't they are not afraid of the wrath of god striking them they believe that god is merciful and grace abounds so they can do anything and get away with it the lands are crying out due to a lot of blood being spilled on it and these are you know ways that um we can checkmate these excesses in the land so that every other person out there would be watchful and careful and equally have that fear of god in them that when they try anything abominable in the land they will be sent away completely never ever to return you know back to that community like I said, let me know your thoughts in the comment section. For now, I say bye-bye. Watch the video if you are able. Yes, here we are in the Akagu security. Uh, the coordinator. The members. Uh, Abraham, the two. The young man, the the law of the land is that they are, they are supposed to leave this loot immediately. So here we are para with Ivu, apart from here, now but I am not ramp, so that they can go any destination actually. Here, 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 and he went in the way any of them. I'm going to loot again. We have himself to blame. More black, more more black, or Joe. I am sure him. I need him to go and loot. So I am from Allah and Gungu and Abba Damba Namba. Oh, here I am sure you make and delude, Mada. Mde wone.